Hello everyone, my name is Mike and I'm the community manager for SimTerect. Today, I'm going to be talking about some really cool pieces of technology that we use to create games like Train Life, a railway simulator which is out now on Steam. Most of the generators that we use to build our worlds are based on Houdini, a 3D procedural software that is used in film, TV, and game development. Our art director, Artur Szymański, gave a lecture at Digital Dragons about using Houdini in game development, so feel free to go check that out using the link in the description. We generate buildings using tools that have been made with the help of Houdini to enable the generation of complex models from base shapes. Buildings in Unreal Engine 4 can be directly created from the engine by level artists without the help of the 3D modeling team in all instances with modular assets and LODs. By having this approach, we are able to create basic shapes near instantaneous buildings that can be generated and modified on the fly to fill empty spaces in levels without having to encumber your artists with trivial work. Creating realistic landscapes can be a huge undertaking for the art department, mostly when requiring dozens of landscapes for a huge open world game. We solve this issue by allowing the artist to paint the vertices of any landscape in Unreal Engine 4, and with the help of a custom pipeline through Houdini, generating a detailed and realistic looking environment is more efficient. Not only does this generate a height map for the landscape, but also vegetation splat maps with landscape layers. All this is done at an amazing resolution with erosion details up to a single meter. Most simulation games need to emulate realistic cities, especially if using real-world landmarks as part of the gameplay, and OpenStreetMap data gives us exactly this regarding buildings, landmarks, and roads. We can have levels ready for aerial viewing or as a basis for level artists to touch up with more detail. Constant iterations of this tool will both increase its precision and speed, all the while enabling designers to move to individual buildings to fit the gameplay needs. And that about wraps it up, ladies and gentlemen. This is only a taste of the production advantages and awesome talent we have here at SimTerect. We hope you enjoyed the video and stay tuned for future insights on the games we develop. Take care.